Hello, my name is Susanna Williamson. I'm the lead vet working on pig disease surveillance within the Animal and Plant Health Agency, and I'm a past president of the Pig Veterinary Society. This is the first of a set of videos which aim to increase awareness about a serious disease of pigs called African swine fever, which is found in wild and domestic pigs in other parts of the world and is causing concern. The videos will tell you about African swine fever, why it's of concern, what it looks like, and how, how you can help reduce the risk of it reaching our pigs here in the UK. The videos are, of course, especially relevant to people who keep pigs, whether that's a single pet pig or pigs on a commercial farm. However, they also have important information about what the general public can do to help protect our pigs. African swine fever is a highly contagious hemorrhagic disease of pigs caused by a virus. Severe strains of the virus are usually fatal to pigs of all ages. However, this virus does not affect people. African swine fever was first detected in EU member states in Eastern Europe in 2014, having spread there from countries further east. The disease has continued to spread in parts of Eastern and Central Europe. This map shows where African swine fever has been reported in 2018 in wild boar and domestic pigs in the Baltic states, Poland, Romania, Moldova, the Czech Republic, Hungary, Bulgaria, Ukraine and Russia. The presence of the disease in continental Europe means there's an increased risk of introduction of African swine fever to pigs in the UK. More recently, in early August this year, African swine fever was reported in China for the first time, and pig herds have been affected in several provinces in different regions of the country. This map shows affected areas of China. As China has around half of the world's pig population, this is a serious development. Large numbers of pigs have died from African swine fever in affected countries and thousands of pigs are having to be euthanised to control disease outbreaks in some countries.